But first, Republicans in Springfield are sounding off about how much it's costing the state to provide free health care uh, to non-citizens. Illinois Senate Minority Deputy Leader Sue Rezin said three years ago when Democrats proposed Medicaid coverage for undocumented people, they promised it would cost the state $2 million a year when they proposed health care coverage for undocumented people. But that cost was exceeded the first month the program was in place. And since then, the program expanded twice along with the cost. State Senator Chapman Rose says the costs are related to the state's estimated budget deficit. Oh, shock. Lo and behold, the amount of money that we've been able to find so far, and by the way, talk about lack of transparency, you can't find all the spending, but never mind that for a minute. You're over a billion dollars in spend on non-citizens. Billion dollar debt, over a billion dollars in non-citizens. Are they correlated? Of course they're correlated. The governor's Office of Management and Budget projects a $422 million net budget surplus for 2024. That's down from a previous forecast of $1.4 billion surplus. For 2025, projecting an $891 million deficit. Scott.